virus is still having a disproportionate impact, though, on our Latino community. In North Carolina, 42% of identified cases are in Hispanic people. It's about 30% in Mecklenburg County, and 66% of those cases are in people younger than 40. And for months, health officials have done targeted outreach in Hispanic neighborhoods to try and help bring down those numbers. Our Aaron Edwards shows us how that effort continued today. Atrium partnered with Progreso Hispano to give out dozens of packs of these masks to small and medium Hispanic businesses in the Charlotte area. It's part of the new normal, wearing a face mask wherever you go in North Carolina. And Atrium Health and Progreso Hispano want to make sure every community in Charlotte has masks available to them. The, the smaller businesses have sometimes were, were forgotten. So this is who we partner with and this is who needs the, uh, the face mask. The event is part of the 2 million mask initiative that Atrium in Mecklenburg County started because of the statewide mandate. And today their focus was on the Hispanic community. We reached out to uh, around 200 small and medium sized local businesses. What I mean uh, medium sized are the grocery stores, the local grocery store and uh, the, the, the mechanic, the landscaping company the beauty salon. Progresso Hispano director Mark Herrera says today's event handing out 8,000 masks was just phase one of a three-phase approach. Phase two would be the businesses that we reached out to that cannot come today. That would be phase two where we're going to go to the businesses and take them the mask. And for phase three, they'll set up at key locations throughout Charlotte where Latino businesses can come and pick up their masks. Progresso Hispano is calling on other organizations to join in to help. I, I challenge the other organizations in the, the, the healthcare industry to, to um, and I'm sure they're doing their, their, their part as well, but those essential workers, you know, I, I challenge them to, to do something like this, to contact us, because we'll be more than happy to put it together. The organizer here today tells me they're hoping to set up another similar event in about 10 days.